So you're thinking about getting a history degree, are you? Well, as a history grad student, let me give you some information and advice. In all of my courses so far, one topic never fails to come up. Do your friends or family doubt your choice of degree? The students don't ask this, but the professors do. So in this episode, I wanna dive into that for you. But first, a history degree can lead to various career paths, including roles in education, research, museum curation, archive management, historical preservation, publishing, journalism, law, government, and even a corporate historian in a business. In education, you can pursue a degree in teaching at different levels from elementary to a university. In research roles, you can work as a researcher in various capacities, such as academic research in universities or research institutions, conducting historical research for thinking tanks, a think tank or policy institution, is a research institute that performs research and advocacy concerning topics such as social policy, political strategy, economics, military, technology, and culture. Or you can work as an independent researcher. In museum curation, that involves managing and curating historical artifacts and exhibitions in museums. It most likely will include educational outreach and interpretation for museum visitors. Archivists preserve and manage historical documents and records in archives, libraries, or government agencies. They may also assist researchers in accessing and utilizing historical materials. Historical preservation is a field that involves preserving historic buildings, sites, and landscapes for future generations. It can include roles in historic preservation organizations, government agencies, or private consulting firms. Historians often write books, research papers, and articles, or other publications on historical topics. You could work as an author, editor, or researcher for publishing companies, academic journals, um, or historical magazines. With how the world is expanding, historians are also using platforms such as podcasts and YouTube to show and tell about topics and their research. Journalism is an area as well in which a historian can use their research and analytical skills to work as journalists, particularly in areas such as investigative journalism, historical reporting, or writing for historical publications. Law is another avenue a historian can provide a strong foundation in, particularly in areas such as legal research writing and analysis. Many lawyers find that their background in history enhances their understanding of legal principles and their ability to construct persuasive arguments. Government and businesses are other avenues as well. Each of these paths offer unique opportunities for historians to apply their knowledge and skills in diverse and meaningful ways. Now, people around you might question a degree in history for several reasons, including concerns about its practicality in terms of job prospects, perceived lack of specialized skills, or stereotypes about historians being limited to academia. However, as we just discussed, there are many unique avenues for you, so don't be discouraged. Historians play a crucial part in preserving, interpreting, and sharing our collective past. Whether through research education or public engagement, historians contribute to a deeper understanding of our world and help shape a more informed and empathetic society. Ultimately, pursuing a degree in history should be seen as an investment in your personal and professional development, offering a rich and rewarding journey with diverse opportunities for growth and impact. No matter your passion, pursuing it will open many doors for you. My advice is to put your earmuffs on to silence those around you, put your blinders on to enhance your focus, and begin fighting for your dreams. Because I found that if you fight for your passions and dreams, they end up fighting for you. So good luck, I know you'll do great, and remember, I'm always here for you.